Julius Wilhelm Richard Dedekind was a German mathematician who made important contributions to abstract algebra, algebraic number theory and the definition of the real numbers. Life Dedekind's father was Julius Levin Ulrich Dedekind, an administrator of Collegium Carolinum in Braunschweig. Dedekind had three older siblings. As an adult, he never used the names Julius Wilhelm. He was born, lived most of his life, and died in Braunschweig. He first attended the Collegium Carolinum in 1848 before transferring to the University of Göttingen in 1850. There, Dedekind was taught number theory by Professor Moritz Stern. Gauss was still teaching, although mostly at an elementary level, and Dedekind became his last student. Dedekind received his doctorate in 1852 for a thesis titled Über die Theorie der Eulischen Integrale. This thesis did not display the talent evident by Dedekind's subsequent publications. At that time, the University of Berlin, not Göttingen, was the main facility for mathematical research in Germany. Thus Dedekind went to Berlin for two years of study. Where he and Bernhard Riemann were contemporaries, they were both awarded the habilitation in 1854. Dedekind returned to Göttingen to teach as a private docent, giving courses on probability and geometry. He studied for a while with Peter Gustav Lejeune de Riclet, and they became good friends. Because of lingering weaknesses in his mathematical knowledge, he studied elliptic and abelian functions. Yet he was also the first at Göttingen to lecture concerning Galois theory. About this time, he became one of the first people to understand the importance of the notion of groups for algebra and arithmetic. In 1858, he began teaching at the Polytechnic School in Zurich. When the Collegium Carolinum was upgraded to a Technische Hochschule in 1862, Dedekind returned to his native Braunschweig where he spent the rest of his life teaching at the institute. He retired in 1894, but did occasional teaching and continued to publish. He never married, instead living with his sister Julia. Dedekind was elected to the Academies of Berlin and Rome, and to the French Academy of Sciences. He received honorary doctorates from the universities of Oslo, Zurich, and Braunschweig. Work while teaching calculus for the first time at the Polytechnic School, Dedekind developed the notion now known as a Dedekind cut, now a standard definition of the real numbers. The idea of a cut is that an irrational number divides the rational numbers into two classes, with all the numbers of one class being strictly greater than all the numbers of the other class. For example, the square root of 2 defines all the negative numbers and the numbers the squares of which are less than 2 into the lesser class, and the positive numbers the squares of which are greater than 2 into the greater class. Every location on the number line continuum contains either a rational or an irrational number. Thus there are no empty locations, gaps, or discontinuities. Dedekind published his thoughts on irrational numbers and Dedekind cuts in his pamphlet, Stetokate und Irrational as Allen, in modern terminology, Val Standardkate, Completeness. Dedekind's theorem states that if there existed a one-to-one -one correspondence between two sets, then Dedekind said that the two sets were similar. He invoked similarity to give the first precise definition of an infinite set. A set is infinite when it is similar to a proper part of itself, in modern terminology, is equinumerous to one of its proper subsets. Thus the set N of natural numbers can be shown to be similar to the subset of N whose members are the squares of every member of N. N1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 0. N21419162536 49648110 Dedekind edited the collected works of Lejeune de Riclet, Gauss, and Riemann. Dedekind's study of Lejeune de Riclet's work was what led him to his later study of algebraic number fields and ideals. In 1863, he published Lejeune de Riclet's lectures on number theory as Volsung and Übersalent theory about which it has been written that 
Although the book is assuredly based on de Ricolet's lectures, and although Dedekind himself referred to the book throughout his life as de Ricolet's, the book itself was entirely written by Dedekind, for the most part after de Ricolet's death. Edwards, 1983 The 1879 and 1894 editions of the Volsungen included supplements introducing the notion of an ideal, fundamental to ring theory. Dedekin defined an ideal as a subset of a set of numbers, composed of algebraic integers that satisfy polynomial equations with integer coefficients. The concept underwent further development in the hands of Hilbitten, especially, of M. E. Noether. Ideals generalize Ernst Eduard Kummer's ideal numbers, devised as part of Kummer's 1843 attempt to prove Fermat's last theorem. In an 1882 article, Dedekind and Heinrich Martin Weber applied ideals to Riemann surfaces, giving an algebraic proof of the Riemann rock theorem. In 1888, he published his short monograph titled Was Sind und Was Sollen die Zahlen, which included his definition of an infinite set. He also proposed an axiomatic foundation for the natural numbers, whose primitive notions were the number one and the successor function. The next year, Giuseppe Pino, citing Dedekind, formulated an equivalent but simpler set of axioms, now the standard ones. Dedekind made other contributions to algebra. For instance, around 1900, he wrote the first papers on modular lattices. In 1872, while on holiday in Interlaken, Dedekind met Georg Cantor. Thus began an enduring relationship of mutual respect, and Dedekind became one of the very first mathematicians to admire Cantor's work concerning infinite sets, proving a valued ally in Cantor's disputes with Leopold Kronecker, who was philosophically opposed to Cantor's transfinite numbers. Bibliography Primary Literature in English 1890. Letter to Kefferstein, im John van Heijenort, 1967. A source book in mathematical logic, 1879-1931. Harvard Univ. Press. 98-103. 1963. Essays on the Theory of Numbers. Beeman, W. Ed. and Trans. Dover. Contains English translations of Stetikate under Rational as Allen and was sind und was soll und Allen. 1996. Theory of Algebraic Integers. Stilwell, John, ed. and Trans. Cambridge Uni. Press. A translation of Uber die Theorie der Ganzan Algebra Allen. Ewald, William B., ed. 1996. From Can to Hilbert. A source book in the Foundations of Mathematics, 2 vols. Oxford Uni. Press. 1854. On the Introduction of New Functions in Mathematics, 754 to 61. 1872. Continuity in Irrational Numbers, 765 to 78. 1888. What are numbers and what should they be? 787 to 832. 1872 to 82. 1899. Correspondence with Cantor. 843 to 77. 930 to 40. Primary literature in German. Gesam Elta Mathematische Worker. Retrieved 5 August 2009. Secondary. Edwards. M. 1983, D. Deacon's Invention of Ideals, Bull, London Math, Sock, 15, 8-17, William Everdell, The First Moderns, Chicago, University of Chicago Press, ISBN 0-226-22480-5, Gillies, Douglas A., 1982, Frager, D. Deakind, and Pino on the Foundations of Arithmetic. Arson, Netherlands, Van Gorkum, Ivergrat and Guinness, 2000, The Search for Mathematical Roots 1870-1940, Princeton Uni, Press, there is an online bibliography of the secondary literature on Dedekind, also consult Stillwell's Introduction to Dedekind.